At the Washington State Department of Social and Health Services Division of Child Support, we often get calls from parents saying, hey, I just got my child support payment and it's less than it's supposed to be. Why is that? We understand how important this payment is to you and that payments for less than you expected could cause a hardship. However, it's likely you're actually getting the right amount. It's just a little confusing because of how it's been divided up by the employer. Each employer is unique and may divide the payment up differently. Let's say the support payment is supposed to be $100 per month. If the paying parent gets paid once a month, it's simple. You would get $100 per month. So $100 per month times 12 months per year equals $1,200 annually in this example. However, not everybody gets paid by the month. Some get paid every other week and others weekly. Federal regulations require employers to divide up the support they take from the paying parent's paycheck by how they pay their employees. If they pay weekly, this means the employer has to divide the $100 monthly payment into smaller weekly payments. But at the end of the year, when you add up all the payments, your annual total would still be the full $1,200 in this example. So to figure out what each support payment will be, you divide the total annual support amount by the number of pay periods. For example, if the employer pays 48 times a year, you would divide the annual support amount, $1,200 in this example, by the number of pay periods, 48. Your payment would be $25 per pay period. Let's say the employer pays 52 times a year. You would divide the annual amount, $1,200, by the number of pay periods, in this case, 52. Your payment would be a little over $23 in this example. So you get smaller payments, but there will be more of them, and they should all be the same amount. When you add all 52 of them up at the end of the year, you'll still get the full $1,200 in this example. Here's another way to look at it. You have a whole pie, and you cut it into four pieces. How much pie do you have now? Right, you still have a whole pie. So we cut those four pieces into 12 pieces. How much pie do you have now? Right again. You still have a full pie, just in smaller pieces. When a paying parent is paid weekly, the employer needs to cut their payments into smaller pieces. But when all is said and done, you still have a full pie, which in this case is the full $1,200 in annual support payments you owed. Just remember though, the employer is the one who decides how to divide up the payments, not the Division of Child Support. If you still have questions about this or any other child support issue, please call us at 1-800-442-KIDS. At the Washington State Department of Social and Health Services Division of Child Support, we promise to provide respect and resources to every person, every day. Thank you.